A.K. Mitch here, doing a little video for my friend, Locking Nut. I tried to do a live stream with this, and uh, the audio just doesn't sound right when you're doing a live stream um, using uh, YouTube. I, I believe uh, YouTube does that auto, audio cancellation thing, and so I'm doing, and it was just not right. So I'm just recording this directly, and I got a new version of OBS 2.1. Uh, 21.12, I think I had 21.1, and it was it just didn't work right. This I'm getting settings like I should have been getting before. I mean, I couldn't adjust the right uh, the right dimensions on my my video now. I am. I mean, I'm just doing 720. No need to do 1080. I'm just trying to save on uh, video size and whatnot. Anyway, and I, I as you can see, I have the Yamaha. TH, THR10X, and I'm using the software I downloaded, so I can do all the controls instead of, it's it's to my left. Actually, hmm, actually you might see it if I lower this, let me lower this down a little bit. Um, I'm not going to let me do it while I'm, I don't think it's going to let me do it while I'm recording. But any, anywho, um, it will, it will. This is it. this out of here, oh. and there it is. There's the Yamaha, the Yamaha T310X. And any any change I make, I'm going to do with the software, and it's going to affect the, uh, the little hand. Anyway, um, what did I do with my pick? Okay, so. I'm still learning it. I don't understand everything about it yet. Uh, I think I did make one. I made a one effect. Now I'm going to step down. Mess around with the controls a little bit. Let's say, uh, let's put let's, let's put effect on it. All right, and do, let's put a little delay. Some reverb. Backing, brown tapping, brown flanger. On, here's chorus. Let's get the press and turn on. Set the stomp and set the rack. Let's have some reverb. Yeah, 
gate. That's wrong. The gate. That's wrong. Here's a 90 wrist lover. Let's see what this is. That's This, I'm using the OBS, OBS software. Like I'm using a software with a THR 10X, and this only I can only input you know the guitar. I can't do nothing else. But with OBS, it lets you do multiple sources. So I'm using the mic with the uh, the built-in mic on the my uh, Logitech from IC20. Um, I have other mics here, but I don't have my. I don't have a mic stand up here, and there most of my stuff is downstairs. But anyway, um, but you know, it's it's sufficient. Like I had the old, the, the last version I had with OBS, which is a screen recording software, um, and you can you can input different track, I mean, different audio sources, um, webcams. But the last version I had it, it just it, it wasn't right, and I just downloaded, got rid rid of it, and there's this new version, and I just pretty much used the default settings, but I was able to get the right um, dimensions on my screen uh, before where I couldn't. It wouldn't let me do it. It only gave me a couple choices and they weren't right. But now I'm doing 720. I'm going to do 1080. And it seems like it's it's working pretty good. But anyway, I put up. <coughs> I just my friend. He wanted a practice stamp. It sounds good to sort. Look, I'm using a headset. You don't have to use a headset. I got this because my wife, she complains with any bit of noise. But I, 
but I can still unplug it and it still retains the sounds. I mean, you know, you're trying to use all these different um, high gain sounds or, or, or whatever. And it still sounds good at low volume. So if you want something to practice, we don't have to have a headset on. This is it. I mean, it's really, really good. I mean, I had a, I had, I, I do have a, a Boss Cantano 100, but even that has like three different settings. It's got a 50 watt, 100 watt, and like a half watt. Even when I'm using half a watt, you know, if I'm not using the headset on that, and I just, you know, playing on low volumes, it sounds all right, but it doesn't get that low. It's still loud, and my wife. You know, even with the doors closed, she's going to scream. But this thing here, it's only, I think, 10 watts. 10 watts, I believe it is. It's got like two, three speakers, I believe. The Yamaha teacher or 10X. But I don't have to use the headset. I can still use it at low volumes. It'll still, the settings will still sound good even at low. And, and my wife doesn't complain. That's, that's a great thing about it. I still want to get another. I, um, I had a, uh, a Black Star. ID core, a lot of people don't like them. I did. I did. I had a 20 watt one, but I kind of traded a whole bunch of stuff in for this uh, this Boss Catan. I don't use it that much, but I, but I was thinking about getting another. They had version 2 out, well, it's been out of the uh, Black Star uh, ID core. I was thinking about getting the, uh, the 40 watt one, but I got some really good sounds out of the 20 watt one that I had, and I kind of wish I could get rid of it. Got rid of it, but oh well. But anyway, let me go back. Let's find some other settings. But this is, it's so, this is so, I mean, customizable. Like, I don't really, I mean, I'm just a bedroom player. I'm, but there, there's this, there's this gentleman, young, young gentleman on uh, YouTube, Cameron Cooper. Young guy, awesome player, never took a, a lesson in his life. If you want to hear this in action, the Yamaha TR 10X, I'd have, I'd have eyes to go to and follow Cameron Cooper. Amazing player. He's very young. He might be in his mid twenties, but he is a fantastic player, and uh, he, he can do the software some really, really good justice. I mean, he sounds really good. But um, but like I said, this is so so customizable. Now it's. Good. So I'm using the default setting here, but then I can add that. Like, like I just picked toolbox. Um, is that the one I picked? No, let me save. Okay, I'm going to use the It's got compression on song. Use that. Up here, and it's probably hard for you guys to see, but you get the idea. On the top, on the top row, it's got your gain master. This is the same thing that's on the end. Um, you can change your speakers. You know, I think the, the block is there. It's got a four by twelve. You want to get a brown? That was a four. Here's a brown four by twelve. That's a little different. You want to get a vintage four by two? Which I do like a lot.
sounds you can get from this thing and like I said I'm just learning how to use this thing and I'll uh, check out Cameron Cooper there's a, a lot of other ones out there too so many days what you're doing but but I think I got a really good deal I think they run around $300 280 on sale well I did this survey Guitar Center asked me to do the survey survey and the Guitar Center said um, I mean, but it wasn't guaranteed I, I believe but anyway, I did this survey and I said I could get a hundred bucks I did it, and then they asked me for another survey, and I did that one over the phone. And they said, I would get 100 bucks. About two months later, I did get it. So I used that. It was a, it was a gift certificate, an electronic gift certificate. So I took, you know, used that to get the $100 off. So it was $200 brand new. I think that's a good deal. So. <laughs> Alright guys, see you later.